Jempak is a fool. If he thinks we can sit idly by while the rest of the galaxy fights the Herc, he's not willing to face the truth. There are Klingons who fear the Herc, hiding behind politics and rules. Grethar waits for their worthless souls. Know this, there are still Klingons who know where their blades belong. We will not dishonor our ancestors and ignore the Herc. We will fight them to our dying breath in the name of Kalos and the Empire! If I can have everyone's... If I can have everyone's attention, thank you. Let's begin the summit. We have a lot to discuss. Thank you all for coming. By now, you should be aware of our tactical situation. The Dominion, as you know it, is on the verge of collapse. We've withdrawn to our core systems, and the lines are holding, for now. Without your help, the Herc will win the War of Attrition. What about your outer systems? We're receiving refugees here, from those areas. We have one fleet left, Admiral. That's hardly enough to defend the entire Dominion. I'm failing to see how this concerns the Empire. The recent battle here is a sample of what the Herc can do. If you think they'll stop at the wormhole, you're sadly mistaken. Need I remind you that the Dominion came to your aid in the Iconian War? I seem to recall Klingons placing high value on debts of honor, or has that changed? Mind your tongue, Changeling! I will not be insulted! Admiral Quinn to Ops, what's happening? We're under attack, Admiral. It's the Herc! Reading her boarding parties. Multiple decks. They've concentrated in the damaged pylons. Or processing area. Get to that damaged pylon section and lock it down before the Herc trigger an explosion that could wreck the station. <laughs> 